Hi! Hi folks. Here's an article that appeared in today's Dallas Morning News. The actual article. This article is in reference to what happened yesterday in South Korea. I think the capital, Seoul, South Korea. The United States Ambassador, Ambassador Lippert, he was slashed, attacked with a knife or a razor by some lunatic in South Korea. That's it, kids. Could you imagine there's a lunatic in South Korea? Well, when I first looked at the article and I heard the news about the ambassador being attacked by a lunatic, it's easy to say, you see, all those Koreans are nuts. But I thought to myself, now wait a minute, we have such attacks here in the United States, and we all know not all Americans are nuts. No, I'm not one of the nuts. At least I like to think so. <laughs> so, you can't just blame all South Koreans. But then when you look further into the story, then you have to say to yourself, well, you know something? It may not be all South Koreans, but it's a good portion of them, if not the society unto itself. And here's why I say this. This person previously committed an act of terrorism or attack, I think a Japanese official, a couple of years ago. A hero in South Korea is this mug. Who is he? He's an assassin. He assassinated a Japanese Prime Minister over a hundred years ago. And to this day, this is their hero. A national hero. So, wait a minute. You have as a national hero an assassin. So people growing up in the schools are taught, Hey, this guy's an assassin and he's our hero. What do you think happens? You try to emulate him. You try to mimic his behavior. We were told George Washington cut down the cherry tree and he told the truth about it. So we tried to emulate that by being honest. We were told Pres <laughs> President Lincoln walked miles to read a book. So we tried to emulate that, not walking the miles reading books. So those were our heroes. This guy is their hero. So what do you think is going to happen? If you promote an assassin as a hero, this is what you get. So yes. There's definitely a problem in South Korea when you have people like this trying to mimic the behavior of a thing like that. See? Very simple. You need to revise who your heroes are. Even the president lunatic there in South Korea sees this as a hero because she asked the Chinese, and they did do it, to make some sort of museum or memorial to this thing at a railroad station in China. See? <laughs> I'm sorry, folks. Like I said, not all South Koreans, but there seems to be a lot of you who think this thing is a hero. There is something wrong. All right. Well, and listen to me. Even though Mr. Lippert is one of them, they're Democrats, he's an American first, and that's why we all take offense to it. You slash one American, you slash us all. We'll see you. God bless you. God bless America. God bless the nation you happen to be in. And God bless Ambassador Lippitt. And I hope his injuries are rather minimal. See ya. <laughs>